All right, gang. You have we reached up. your destination. We pulling up now, gang. <clears throat> At the Benz dealership. Um, arriving casually late. But uh, hopefully uh, they got something nice on the lot. While we wait for the car to get serviced, um, they look like they got some kind of construction or something going on in this job. Look kind of crazy. I don't know what's going on, but it's going to be it's going to be quite something. Hold on, guys. Hello. I see y'all got the construction over here. Normally we go over here. So what? Yeah, so, we have it. The, all the advices are there. So if you leave, if you have an appointment, yeah. Okay, perfect. You could leave the car there. You could turn it off. Leave the keys, and you could go through there, and there will. Oh, okay. Somebody get it from here. Yeah. All right. Thanks. All right. So as you can see, they got construction and stuff going on. I gotta leave the car here. So that's what I'm gonna do. You can see that I need a a, a service done. Or whatever i got engine lights and stuff like that going on so let me hurry up and get out this car so we can get inside and get the service underway i'll see y'all on the inside all right saying goodbye to my baby they're about to take her to the back we're about to get an oil change and uh fill up that wiper fluid and whatever else comes along with an a service i just took her through the car wire so she's not looking that bad but uh, as you can see, they got construction going on. Normally, it look a little more uh, better than this, but better things to come. So let's go on the inside and get the paperwork done. All right, guys. So this is the CLS 450 2021. This thing is a beaut. Look at the wheels on that. This is gorgeous. I think those like 20s or 22s. What are those? What are these? These are 20s. 275, 30R20s. That's gorgeous. Let's look at the interior. This is so gorgeous. CLS 450, 2021, I believe. That is gorgeous. Look at the wood trim. That is gorgeous. It's not bad, dark brown leather seats. Interior is popping, sunroof. Moon roof, whatever you want to call it. Oh, look at the dash. This is so different from mine. I mean, mine looks something like this, but this is like, like one flat screen. Like this, it's crazy. It's crazy. That is so nice. Let's see how much space we got in the back. Oh, look at that. Look how that window. That window hit. Space is in the back. That's nice. Let's go back to the front again. Yeah, that's good. That is so hot. Sunroof. Let's take a look around back. You can see it. CLS 450. You know, I just thought I'd give you guys a. Uh, a walk through while I'm getting my car service. But this is sweet, man. God, look at that interior. That is gorgeous. It's the wood for me. It's definitely the wood for me. And that's what she said. <laughs> well, let's take a look at this beauty right here. This one. This is the one. This one is crazy. This is a coupe. Look at those seats. Seats are beautiful. 
beautiful, beautiful detail. Let's look at that center console. This is nice. That wide view is crazy. Yes, sir. I don't know. Open this. That's gorgeous. AMG on the wheel, on the wheel sill. I mean, a door sill. That's nice. Uh, I'm not a fan of this, but the rest of it is gorgeous. It's that center. It's that center console. That center console is gorgeous. Always been a fan of coupes. This one right here is crazy. <laughs> well, we got uh, V8 by Turbo. So you already know this thing doing numbers. Gorgeous vehicle. Well, we got the AMG. AMG GTC. Not sure what the C stand for, but this is a coupe right here. I think they said it's 140000 for this one. We got the AMG wheels or whatever. I think these uh, 19s, yeah, it's 19s. They say it right there. I prefer 20s, but they come with 19s. So that's good. But look at that. That's a beaut. This is beautiful. Oh God, that thing is that thing is a masterpiece. That's a masterpiece, y'all. Put this on your bucket list. I'm not sure what year this is, but it's probably a 20. I don't see them having nothing older than a 20 in the showroom. This thing is. Whew. You know what, guys? Let's get some smooth, buttery B-roll of this. Because I think that is only right that we get some B-roll of this gorgeous masterpiece of a vehicle. In 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. So that last one was the uh, the 2020 AMG GTC. I don't know what the C stand for, like I said, but um, hope y'all enjoyed that smooth buttery B roll. I thought that you know that car definitely deserved to have B roll done to it, you know, with the with the, with the slow mo. But um, yeah, we uh we out here, we on the lot, we looking at the the different flavors of stuff that they got out here and um right now in the section where i'm at it ain't really much to look at other than you know the old the older johns i mean new to some people but just like older meaning like not 21 20 stuff like that not everything but they got some all right stuff out here this right here is, is nice yes sir look at that whoo that Porsche right there, 718 Cayman, GTS baby. That thing sweet, black on black, with the with the factory stock 22s on there. So really, you don't even I gotta really even get nothing on that. But look at that. That thing is nice. Think it's nice. Do this open? No, nah, that don't open. This joint a little dusty though. You know what I'm saying? Sitting out here by the road or whatever, but. 
then you got that little Porsche right there next to it or whatever that one but dang nothing major this one right here is an 18 you can see it on the sticker that's a 2018 John but it's it's right look at this baby right here this blue the blues clues baby give you the blues this thing crazy that thing crazy right there baby give you the blues look at that yes sir oh and i like the rims on this john the rims that come on this john factory is nice as shit look at those them things are sweet i like that shade of gray with the porsche logo on there those 22s also by the way but it looked like the ones on the back is slightly bigger than the ones on the front so i guess they would call that a staggered fitment look like 22s on the back and uh 21s on the front because the back wheels are definitely larger but this thing right here is crazy what porsche is this oh okay that's the 911 yes sir that 911 is wicked the blue on that and everything is crazy let's see what the inside look like can we see the inside is the door open no nah, the door not open what's the sticker price sticker price on this is what 129,000 so 129,000 what year is this 21 21 911 Carrera so if you got 124,000 you can get yourself one of these this thing's stupid you know what I mean the joint next to it nice too but I, I think this one right here is better definitely what's this one look at that grill yes sir big boy grill i like that i wish my i wish my car had that grill but unfortunately it don't but the next one i get definitely gonna have a big boy grill i'm not sure what model this is what's this y'all can see that 2021 amg glc 43 let's see what the inside look like i know the doors is locked can we see the inside no not really through the glare of the glass I was hoping that they had a, a, a 2021 S out here, but ain't no S classes out here. They said that the S class is coming in June. Here go a, here go a S, but that's an older model, which is still nice. I like it. That's somebody car that belong here. We got all these joints out here, all different types of SUVs and stuff. You know what I mean? Nothing major out here, nothing too major. You know, nothing too major. But, you know, the typical SUVs and stuff. Nothing too major. What they got in the back? What we got? I think this is a GLC. Yeah, I think that's a GLC right there. What's that? Oh, GLB, 2021 GLB. Not sure if y'all can see that real good, but 2021 GLB. Formatic, can we see the inside? Can we see the inside? Not really, but maybe a little bit. The glare of the glass is messing it up. What's this? This is another E-Class 18. Oh no, C class 18. That's nice. Ooh, what's this red one right here? This red one. What is this? This might be a 2021 A class. I'm not sure. Let's see what the sticker say. This is uh 2021 CLA 250. Four Matic. You got 45 grand, 46 grand, you can get yourself one of these. I like this color a lot. I'm not a fan of the wheels, but I like the color a lot. Red is my favorite color. Can't get into the inside, they all locked. But, you know, ooh, what's this in the back? It's an 18. What's that? It's a nice grill. This is a, uh, what is this? 2018 CLA. Oh, okay. It got the racing stripes in the seats. 
I don't know how good y'all can see that through the glare. Let's see what the dash look like. The windows and stuff is dusty. It's not bad. It's not bad. But I'm really feeling this one right here. Out of all the, the smaller ones. This color is dope. But yeah, that's that's pretty much all they got out here right now is what you see. It ain't really too much. I was hoping to see more S classes or the 2021 20, S classes, but you know, there's a lot going on. They say that uh they'll be coming to the lot in June. So I definitely will be looking forward to that because I'm definitely um thinking about upgrading to the 2021 s-class let's go in the back and see what they got as far as porsche i know they probably got some, some 2021 porsches in the back let's see what they got yes sir look at that damn now that's what i'm talking about right there i need to pull some of these out the garage on y'all for the summer that porsche is a beaut I don't know how good y'all can see that color, but Jesus Christmas. It's like some kind of pearl blue or something. Yo, this joint is nice. What's that, the uh, the Taycan? It got a little um, digital dash in the center. Something like a Tesla or whatever right there. I don't know how good y'all can see that. Something like a Tesla, but this joint is nice. What we got yes sir the Titan 4s that's nice right there the Titan 4s i love this color and of course the doors are locked so i can't let y'all really see the interior this is what the wheels look like that's not bad wheels not bad that's not bad at all i like those headlights Know what I'm saying your classic Porsche logo right there. Let's zoom in on that. I love that Porsche logo. That's hot. They need to make that into a belt. <laughs> then we got another one in black right here. She's a beaut too. That's like some kind of pearl black. I don't know if y'all can really see the effects. These rooms are a thousand times better than the last rooms. Look at those babies right there. Yes, sir thousand times better what's the what's the price on this this is a hundred and thirty nine thousand sheesh 139 baby 139 i don't know if y'all can see that up there but it's 139 on the on the tag you know what i mean you got the you got the bread and you can afford it it's 139 I don't know. I feel like the insides of these are kind of plain. Ooh, look at this. Two-tone wheels. That's dope. That is dope. Ew, yes. But the interior on this one is definitely better. I like the interior on this one. That's locked, too. I just figured I'd see if I can get in there. What's this? Ooh, 170. Jesus Christ. That's a hell of a price tag right there. 170 sheesh and then we got some porsche suvs out here for y'all for your liking if you're an suv person and then they got like some old cars and stuff like that but for the most part like that's pretty much all they got it's pretty much all they got so i mean i wish i could have you know more stuff to show y'all from this lot while i wait to get this oil change but i was really hoping like i said to see if they had the 2021 s class because when i upgrade that might be it or the amg gt the four-door coupe what they like to call it that's a beast too but i don't know I'm, I'm surprised that they didn't have any of those on the lot i thought that they would have some of those on the lot but they definitely didn't have none of those on the lot so you know, you got people out here car shopping and stuff, looking for, uh, you know, new vehicles and stuff for themselves. You know, it's summertime and with the economy and stuff being the way that it is, it's like 
the perfect time for car shopping and stuff because you can definitely get more bang for your buck as far as trading your car right now if you wait till the pandemic is over your car is going to be worth a lot less so since cars are scarce right now and they're worth more so now is the time to trade in and get you know get your upgrade so i hate for y'all to miss out i'm going to try to upgrade mine before the pandemic is over so that um i could definitely get more bang for my buck but i'm about to go back inside into the waiting area and sit down i still got videos to edit from yesterday's vlog that i still ain't edit yet you know so that's still coming but by the time y'all see this video y'all already will be the scene the video before this the memorial day vlog but um yeah guys i hope y'all enjoyed this content you know at the mercedes dealership and um i think i'm gonna end the vlog right here you know only thing i got left to do is just to uh sit down and wait for the um you know for them to give me a buzz back and let me know that my car is ready they was gonna wash it but i already washed it so that saves about 35 40 minutes and uh as per usual you know my car is in good hands and i'm just waiting but you know if you guys like this video give it a thumbs up you know what i'm saying like share subscribe definitely oh go to my instagram follow me on the gram at i z h a e U N C U T I J Uncut on Instagram, where I'm going to be, you know, posting real stories, photos, and things of that nature. So definitely follow me there. I'm gonna try to hop on the TikTok wave, uh, the TikTok bandwagon, or whatever. I'm not really a TikToker, you know what I'm saying? My kids do TikToks, I don't really know how to how you TikTok, but I'm not gonna be doing no dancing TikToks or nothing like that because I'm not a dancer or a prancer, you dig? But like I said, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.